What's up, guys? Pet Man here, Carolina Varsity, taking a look at the uh, Southwestern 4A Conference as we get ready to start conference play. Uh, it's been pretty obvious so far to um, most of us that Butler is the uh, favorite here, um, having uh, only lost one game to Mallard Creek. Defense is obviously playing well. Offense is starting to come into its own. Um, so it's really Butler and then a race for second place. So who's going to, who could challenge Butler? Um, you're going to have to have, you know, a running game and a passing game to keep them off balance. And, you know, you look at the, the contenders, Myers Park, you know, we've seen them throw the ball pretty well, but can they run it enough? Uh, Independence kind of the opposite of that. They've been running it, you know, primarily on offense. The passing game hadn't really developed quite yet. And then you got Rocky River, who's got a nice dual-threat quarterback and a, a pretty good running back to go along with that. But can they throw the ball enough to uh, keep, you know, Butler honest? Um, and then East Mech is kind of a wild card in there. They can run the ball. Um, they, they have some ability to throw it, but I, I don't know if they have enough ability to, to challenge a Butler. Uh, but really, those, those five teams right there are, I think, your top five in the Southwestern Conference. Um, right now, you're looking at Myers Park as probably the number two team. Um, but it, they're not going to run away with it. You know, I, I definitely think the, the games between Myers Park Independence and Rocky River are going to go a long way. And Myers Park and Rocky River actually play coming up this week. So that's going to be a real big game coming out the gate of conference play to, to kind of see who's going to be in that number two spot. And that's a, very important for playoff seeding, as we know the top three teams in the conference get um, automatic bids to the playoffs as long as they have four wins. So uh, looking at that, you know, Myers Park has already got three wins and Independence is in a pretty good spot. Uh, Rocky River's got some work to do. They've only got one win so far and um you know, they're going to have to win these conference games. They're not going to be easy. I expect them to be in a lot of tight games here. Uh, Porter Ridge, um, they were starting to play a little bit better, uh, but, you know, it had some struggles against Olympic. Um, you know, that's kind of kind of not of a good sign to be going, you know, trending down, I guess you would say, heading into uh, conference play. And then Garinger, you know, we are, we've, we've discussed the struggles Garinger has had and, you know, some things they really need to focus on. They do have a JV. They played Harding on JV um, this past Thursday, so that's good to see that um, going to be able to, to develop for the future. And uh, I think that's where you start looking now if you're Garinger. Uh, try to do what you can on the varsity, but really work on that JV and get those guys, you know, in tune with what you want to do um, for your program. So really in my assessment, Butler's number one. Uh, right now i got Myers Park two. Uh, Independence third, Rocky River fourth, East Mech fifth, Porter Ridge sixth, and Garinger seventh. Yeah, I think your dark horse is East Mech. They've won two in a row. They're starting to uh, get some things going there in terms of momentum and playing well on both sides of the ball. Uh, also, Independence, obviously, they're, with their tradition and talent they have, you'd expect them to start getting better and, you know, maybe make a push for that number two spot and, you know, even challenge Butler in that uh, conference finale they have every year so you know right now that's the southwestern conference um it's butlers to lose in my opinion as long as they stay healthy and um, you know avoid any kind of you know crazy controversy or, or anything like that i think they're they're going to take the conference and have a high seed going into the playoffs so if you think differently go ahead and post yours uh below this um thank you guys for watching good luck in the conference